pork sandwich, vegan poutine, fries from the Sponge Cat Fry Company. It fits right in here. Like it going. Oh yeah, that's like Satan gargoyle, all right? We got another one, check it out, check it out right here. Oh, that's like Droopy. Oh yeah, Droopy. there's a homeboy right there. <laughs> He's real meat. He's real hungry. He's real hungry, like me. All right, so I'm excited here. I'm at the Spud Shack Fry Company. We're with Dan Close, who is the owner and president of this company. Dan, thank you so very much for having us. Oh, our pleasure. Thanks for uh, coming in. Excellent. So just to let you know, uh, I am actually going to have the pulled pork sandwich. And David is actually going to have a vegan poutine because he's a vegan. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, fantastic. You're a great man. Poutine's not really something that a vegan is supposed to be eating because of all the cheese curds and everything. But these guys have this amazing like soy cheese and even the gravy is, it's not real gravy, it's soy, but you would never know. And he brought us out these flights of beer. First of all, I'm gonna have a nice taste of beer here. I'll tell you that's refreshing after our hot day outside in the sun. All right, I'm gonna grab a taste of this. It's amazing. I love this place. They also have a quinoa burger. Totally vegan burger as well. This is the place to be to be a vegan or a vegetarian. It's so hard with this kind of diet to find a restaurant where you can have comfort food like this. We have found it just across the way here in the U.S. I'm sorry to disappoint you, Damon, but I am not a vegan. <laughs> and I will be enjoying my pulled pork sandwich. Oh, look at that puppy. Oh, that baby is nice. Uh, so there's something new that's on your menu, is that correct? Uh, yeah, I made a few changes this week. Uh, the signature one will be the butter chicken poutine. So, got a nice uh, marinated uh, chicken thighs uh, simmered in a creamy uh, tomato sauce. So yeah, Excellent. So tell, tell us a little bit about the sauce. Uh, butter chicken is definitely something that's quite popular in yeah, the city yeah. of Surrey. And I think, uh, also I'm sure, in the rest of Metro Vancouver. So tell us a little about that secret sauce that you, that you got going on there with the butter chicken. Uh, you know, we, we, we do it over two days. So we, uh, we steep and uh, marinate the, uh, the milk with carmen pods and cinnamon and lots of spice and flavor. And then uh, the next day we, uh, we cook it with the tomato sauce. And then the chicken goes in and it's all simmered and uh, it's, it's gorgeous. So what was the inspiration behind you starting this business? Because you must be quite a foodie. Uh, I can tell by how yeah, passionate yeah. you are when you explain your food. Um, tell us a little bit about that inspiration. Uh, I think, you know, my, my business partner and I were big into uh, triathlons and, and sporting goods. And, uh, you know, it's kind of a guilty pleasure eating the fries. And, uh, you know, we, we decided, you know, let's make a business of it. Let's do something. And uh, I, I kind of originally said food truck. He said restaurant. We kind of, you know, kind of went this way. And kind of came up with old world Europe meets the West Coast and uh, you know everyone loves fries you're in Canada you got to do poutine you're on the West Coast you got to do fish and chips and so if you do all of that you know we got to have a great burger and great sandwiches and and then 20 something beers right now your location now this is a great location you are right here at the footstep of new West, new Westminster SkyTrain station so you must get quite the foot traffic here yeah, I think, you know, lots of visibility, a lot of uh, eyeballs, and a lot of great repeat customers. You know, you got all the new towers here. Uh, Trap and Holbrook just opened up, so there were 600 new people uh, coming into the community. And the whole community as a, as a whole has really changed, and, uh, you know, we're seeing really good uh, revitalization and really cool energy, a lot of young, uh, kind of new homeowners coming into the area and uh, so yeah and this SkyTrain is so unique having retail space within the SkyTrain so it kind of was a good fit for us and uh, it's been great so far. So you know what they say uh, the key to a man's heart is uh, through his stomach you agree with that? Oh absolutely you know being a foodie and uh, you know constantly trying and testing and eating uh, it's, it's heaven here. What's your most popular dish? Uh, poutines by far, and the, the specialty poutine would be the bacon poutine or the baked potato. Excellent. Well, it smells absolutely delicious. I'm so lucky to be standing back here right now with Dan Close. Dan, if there's one word that you can describe your food, I'm not talking about one particular meal, but your food in general, what would that word be? Wow, there's so many. I, awesome, but uh, I think, you know, just passion. You know, I think we put a lot of effort, a lot of passion into the food. It's kind of well thought out, but it's still casual at the same time. and. Uh, you know, we like to have fun here and, uh, you know, we don't take it too seriously. The food we take very seriously, but we don't take ourselves too seriously. There you have it, folks. Dan Close with the Spud Shack Fry Company. 
passion is what they're bringing to you. This food is going to be absolutely delicious because I can smell it. I'm excited about this, Dan. Thanks for having us. Thank you. All right. We're going to bring you all the action bite by bite right here on Surrey604.com. Okay. Well, I'm going in. I'm going in, guys. You fit that in your mouth? I think I can. He's got a big mouth, so it should work out. Here we go. <laughs> mm. Oh yeah. The cold slot, the pulled pork, the sauce, the bun, everything just comes right together. So Sook, if you could describe your burger in one word, what would that word be? Delicious. There you have it folks, the Spud Shack in New West. Absolutely delicious. Sook Joe Hall, Damon Beatty, Surrey, 604.com. Uh, we got our signature, which is uh, Andalusia mayo, which is uh, smoked paprika, tomato paste, fresh oregano, a few other secret ingredients, uh, a roast garlic, and uh, a honey mustard tarragon. Excellent. I'm excited, so I'm going I'm to dive in. Get here. in there, right? Get it while it's warm. Okay. All right. Okay, Marco. You know, you threw around me yesterday, now, last Oh, yeah. Delicious. If you ain't come here before, you gotta get down here. You gotta try these dips with these fries. Absolutely incredible. We'll try one more. So creamy. <laughs> There's a real texture with the sauce. You can really feel that in your mouth. And the fry, the crunch of the fries when it comes. Oh. Makes my mouth water. I'm gonna go in for another one. <laughs>